Firefighters hung a French flag on Paris's Eiffel Tower on August 25th in memorial of the liberation of Paris during World War II. The flag hanging was reminiscent of the moment the French tricolor was flown on the iconic monument after the end of Nazi rule in the French capital 75 years ago. The flag itself has a fascinating story. On August 25th, 1944, French firefighters climbed the Eiffel Tower and hung the flag as battle raged throughout the city. Jean Marie Bardouche recalls the story of her father who took part in this amazing ceremony. They arrived. They surveyed around a bit to see if the Germans could see them around the Eiffel Tower. Since they saw no one, they climbed through the stairs, of course, since the elevators weren't working yet. I mean, Germans were controlling the elevators and they couldn't use them. It's rather that. So they walked up and he put up the flag. Hers was not the only story that was shared at the event. As the liberation of Paris involved the combined Allied forces, there were several armed service members from around the world in attendance. Well, I'm honored to be here for this event, and, uh, and I'm physically able to be here. A lot of our veterans are not able to be, would like to be, but um, it's, it's my pleasure to be here as a guest and uh, participate in your celebration of, uh, of the liberation of Paris. The day will also be marked by a public parade and the opening of the Liberation Museum. To understand the significance of the celebration, it is key to look back on what happened all those decades ago. The liberation of Paris consisted of six days of fighting between Allied and Axis forces. Firefights erupted sporadically across the city and barricades were put up. French resistance forces and the U.S. 4th Infantry Division were key in defeating the occupying forces of the French Vichy regime and the German army. The Germans surrendered on August 25th at the Hotel Maurice in central Paris.